10 Most Powerful Industrial Machines. In this video, we'll talk about Gyratory Crusher, employed to break huge rocks, SLJ900 for building bridges, Universal Alloy Corporation, the aluminum alloy component producers, Wartzilla RT Flex 96C, an extravagant engine, Big Musky, a dragline excavator, Three Gorges Dam, most powerful hydroelectric gravity dam, the Taijun Crane, a powerful crane, Bagger 293 bucket wheel excavator used at a coal mine, the Muir group ship loader, a rapid ship loading mechanism, Komatsu blast hole drill to create holes in mines. Keep watching to know more. Number 10. Gyratory Crusher In mines and ore production plants, gyratory crushers are used to break huge rocks into smaller, more manageable bits that may be then be crushed down to extract valuable material. They operate by opening a gap into which a rock falls, then shutting and crushing it before opening it again so that the resultant debris may sink underneath and a new, huge rock piece can fall in to continue the process. The method has been utilized for decades, but it has become obsolete as better materials have been created. The largest kind of gyratory crusher machine is called the KB-63-130. Two of them are now being erected at the Iron Bridge Mining Project in the Pilbara region of Western Australia. Number 9. SLJ-900 Have you ever glanced at a bridge and thought about how one is built so quickly? For projects that must be finished on time, specialized equipment known as a launching gantry is used. It is used to set up pre-made blocks. The largest and most powerful of them is known as the SLJ-932, and it was particularly created in China to help with huge infrastructure projects going on around the country. It can transport, hoist, and put various portions of road or railway track, and after a hefty stone block has been deposited, it may travel forward over the next gap and dump another one. And this process is continued until you see a big bridge next time. Number 8. Universal Alloy Corporation Universal Alloy Corporation is one of the world's major aluminum alloy component producers and in 2005 built the largest extrusion press to meet demand. The 122-foot-long machine was initially developed in Germany during World War II to create airplane components. It had to be totally deconstructed before being transported due to its weight of 16,000 tons. The vehicle was then refurbished before being rebuilt at the company's factory in Canton, Georgia. With just a single machine, the firm could triple its output. Number 7. Wartzilla RT-Flex 96C Car manufacturers are continually displaying their latest engines that deliver greater power than ever before. Still, none of them compare to the immensity of the Wartzilla RT-Flex 96C engine manufactured in Finland. This diesel engine was developed to power the Maersk cargo ship, which can reach a peak speed of 31 knots, which is one-third quicker than other ships in its class. To do this, the engine is by far the most efficient of its kind. Yet the weight is nearly astounding at 2,300 tons. It stands 44 feet tall and 90 feet long making it taller than a four-story structure. Number 6. Big Musky Dragline excavators are mining devices that remove excess from the material that will eventually be mined. Bucyrus Erie constructed the largest one ever made, dubbed Big Musky. It weighs 13,000 and a half tons. It stands more than 22 floors tall making it one of the world's biggest moving vehicles. When it was operational, it was 487 feet long, 151 feet wide, and 222 feet tall, and it could travel along the ground using two hydraulically driven walker feet. It had a 220 cubic yard bucket, 
making it the largest and strongest single bucket machine ever built. And it could transport a maximum weight of 325 tons at one time. Number five, Three Gorges Dam. Three Gorges Dam, erected over the Yangtze River in Sandu Ping in central China, is the world's largest and most powerful hydroelectric gravity dam. Construction was completed in 2006, but it took another six years before everything was fully operational, and it became the world's biggest power station in 2012. The building is 594 feet tall, 7,600 feet long, and between 131 and 377 feet broad with an installed capacity of 22,000 megawatts at a time. However, the reservoir it built encompasses 419 square miles and is 370 miles long to generate such massive amounts of power. Number four, the Taijun Crane. The shipping business works with some of the heaviest gear and equipment, from cargo to the components required to make the biggest of vessels, powerful cranes are required to lift and position these things properly. The Taijun Crane, placed at the Raffle Shipyard in Yantai, China, is the world's largest and most powerful crane. The crane was particularly designed and built to load integrated modules onto the hulls of boats under construction, which required it to be capable of lifting weights of up to 20,000 tons. Number three, Bagger 293 Bucket Wheel Excavator. The Bagger 293 is a bucket wheel excavator that was constructed in 1995. It is used at a coal mine in Hamburg, Germany to cut and remove overburden to uncover the resources beneath. A massive wheel at the front constantly chops away at the dirt and places it on conveyors that transport it to vehicles for disposal. The Bagger 293 is suitable for the work since the mine is among the most prolific in the world. The machine is 738 feet long, 151 feet wide, 314 feet tall, and weighs a little over 14,000 tons. Number two, the Muir Group Shiploader. The shipping sector is unquestionably the backbone of the global economy. A little increase in ship speed or turnaround time in port can significantly influence profit margins. The capacity of a port to load and unload ships is one of the most crucial aspects of the operation. They accomplish this by having a powerful and rapid shiploading mechanism. The Muir Group manufactures one of the broadest ranges of these devices, which are particularly intended to function with ships of various sizes. Number one, Komatsu Blast Hole Drill. Mining businesses must use a variety of procedures to recover the valuable rocks that lay beneath the ground. When the veins are near the surface, an excavator is an ideal machine to use, but drills are required to create holes to provide access when the veins are much deeper. A blast hole drill is among the most powerful alternatives. Komatsu just introduced a new range that is more robust than ever before. The PH-77XR has a bit payload of 38 tons and is intended to react to various ground conditions. It may be used for rotating trichon drilling or mechanical hammer drilling and has an auto bit changing mechanism for a little downtime. So, which one was the most intriguing? Comment below. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like, share, and subscribe button. Thanks for watching.